Greetings, 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 my V family all over the world. This is your chief. Welcome to week 42, guys. It's crazy. We just closed week on last week. All right. We are in a brand new week. We are back in Kuala Lumpur. I pray that all the VCon participants, you guys are back in your markets, back with your team. You are rocking it, okay? Applying everything you guys have learned, all right? I just spoke to Dato Sri Vijay every day after VCon, all right? And both of us were just talking about how magical our experience together, uh, you know, with Japa, the first physical VCon after two and a half, three years to see the 15,000 amazing downlines of ours from all over the world to see the V ambassadors, the core, the alliance. It was simply a magical experience. And I shared on my last Wednesday message a summary of what I spoke to about VCon on my Sunday Instagram, which I was right, you know, lack of sleep because after VCon I came back to Pataling Jaya, non-stop meetings with all your uplines, planning the remaining months of the unbelievable 2022, sharing the vision of Dato Sri Vijay with everyone, instilling that power, that passion, that mojo in your uplines. And now you guys are back in your markets. I hope you guys are rocking it. All right, uh, I've still got tons of meetings this week uh, to put the final touches to the closing of the year, which I think is crucial. We have about 10 more weeks before we say goodbye to 2022. And I know that those who came to VCon, those who followed us on uh, social media throughout VCon, I, I, I upload behind the scenes, right, five days of VCon. Uh, after VCon. So there's a follow through, the excitement. I hope you guys saw my videos. I hope you guys subscribe to VTube Plus where you will see full modules of the V partners if you are subscribed to VTube Plus. And um, I was thinking the last two, three days speaking to all your uplines, the leaders, and I was trying to come to some level of conclusion of what is their secret of success. What have they done that has put them up there as a max out king or queen or a VC, AVP, V partner. And I've come to two conclusions that I want to share with you guys, okay, all over the world. Uh, remember your dream, guys. Before I go into my two conclusions, remember your dream. Make QNET the biggest decision of your life. Make it one of your biggest decisions, all right? Uh, rejection is part and parcel of our business. So remember the song, I don't care, I love it. All right. Uh, don't live in fear of what people think of you. That is your greatest fear. Get over it, you know. Do whatever you have to do, but get over that fear. And uh, this journey is going to be full of challenges, full of, uh, you know, things trying to stop you, people trying to stop you, uh, steal your dream, kill your decision. All you have to be is you got to be a warrior and don't succumb to them. All right. This is your life, your journey, your dream, your journey of financial freedom. All right. Is your God given right? Don't give it away to some morons out there who don't pay your bills. All right. Uh, recognize the value proposition of your uplines. Be grateful to the relationships that you've established with your downlines and uplines. Always be grateful to the guy or girl who signed you up. All right. Even if they're not active, send them a thank you note because they opened the door and you walked into the greatest family, the V family. All right. Uh, you have nothing to fear, guys. We have Japa and Dato Sri Vijay, our great founders, leading us every step of the way. I'm here. All right. The V partners, the AVPs, the, the V councils, you belong. You are, you, are, you are very safe in our hands. But now you're out there. You're, you're doing the work. And I want you to recognize these two great conclusions, which I think is the, the, the key characteristic of success that I found throughout the leaders I've spoken to after VCon. Number one, all right, if there's one thing about all these people who have succeed, succeeded and achieved greatness in network marketing, in our business with QNET and the V, is they listen. They're great students, but they apply. The problem with most people I observe, 
when they get into network marketing, they are overwhelmed. You are overwhelmed, all right? Even at this VCon, with a vast amount of information, uh, concept, theories, this, that, everything from the great ones, you hear so much, all right? You are like overloaded with information, new knowledge, new realization, the click. So many things is happening here. So many things is happening in your heart. But you see, all right, if you truly want to be successful, it's not what you know. It is not the knowledge you have acquired. It's not about understanding this industry or this business or this lifelong search for searching for the secret. I, I realize in all the, the, the top performers in QNET and the V, your uplines, there's one thing common in all of them. They apply everything they learn. Even if they learn this much, they apply everything. See, Dato Sri Vijay told me, Patman, a guy who has this much knowledge and applies this much is going to max out. The problem is there's a lot of people with this much knowledge and they only apply that much. All right? So it's not about how much knowledge you have. It's about how much knowledge you apply. So after this week on, you have to apply the knowledge. You have to wake up in the morning, play Latika, close your eyes, remember your dream. All right, you actually have to play that song. I don't care. I love it. If you face a rejection or you're facing a challenge or facing a problem, you have to remember the words of Dato Sri Vijay. Do it now. Have a sense of urgency. That means you have to apply it. Right? How do you apply the sense of urgency of Dato Sri Vijay is that you basically don't postpone anything. Don't procrastinate because you are distracted by a movie or your social life or your cat is sick or your mother-in-law wants you to be at home and spend more time with your family. You stay focused. Do not procrastinate. All right. And is this a big decision? If this is a big decision, you need to make sacrifices. So you literally have to apply this concept of making sacrifices and paying the price. So the mistake a lot of people make, they acquire all this knowledge from VCon, you know, like that or do it now, or get up again, be the change, all right? You take all of this and you feel good, but then you don't get the desired result. And after months or weeks, you say, oh my God, all right? Nothing is changing. The reason is you're not applying. You are not exactly applying what you have learned. That means what happens, you come from here, you come to VCon, you are elevated in your mindset, your passion, your power, your inspiration, your click, your paradigm shifts. But then when you go back to the outside world, after a while, you come back to the same person you were before you come to VCon. So your ultimate duty after VCon or after attending any training where you had the click is to make sure you don't regress to become the same person you were before. And the people who regress are the people who don't apply. Because if you don't apply the knowledge you have acquired, if you don't apply the paradigm shifts, the clicks practically on your journey, you will not see desired results. Now, when you don't see desired results, you start to lose faith and you go back to becoming the moron you were before. This is very common. So apply what you have realized. Apply what you have learned. I told you the importance of presentation, presentation, presentation. So go back now, consistently do the presentation. All right, walk the talk. Okay, be a warrior. That means when the challenge comes, you will immediately naturally want to be a wimp. But remember the switch and then you be a warrior at that time. All right, and say the words, I am a warrior, whatever it takes. But apply what you have learned. Application is 99%. Acquiring knowledge is 1%. Anyone can read a book. Anyone can watch a movie. Anyone can listen to a self-help podcast. So what? All right? Okay, anyone can have great mentors. See, I have a great mentor called Dato Sri Vijay. And the reason why I've succeeded in life is not because he's a great mentor. Because I applied what he said. Right, so having the greatest mentor without application of what you have learned from them is completely useless. It's like watching a movie. A lot of people watch a movie, get emotional, I want to change my life. And then tomorrow morning, they go back to their pathetic existence. So you guys need to change. You guys need to apply what you have learned practically. Play Latika. Remember your dream. Right on the mirror, I don't care, I love it. Regardless of how many rejections you get, count your rejections. When you reach a thousand, call me. All right? Remember that this is not going to be an easy journey. You've got to be a warrior. Remember that your greatest fear is what people think of you. Get rid of it. Go outside to your garden right now after the Wednesday message. Act like a monkey. So what? 
So apply, 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 apply. All right? And you will succeed. Acquiring knowledge and keeping it here is completely useless. So if you realize, I was talking to all the great leaders, the max out kings and queens. They have no more knowledge than you. They may have less knowledge than you about this industry, what to do, what is right, what is wrong. But they have applied a lot of it right to the max. That's why they're successful. The second characteristic I, met, I realized about all these people is consistency. You see, a lot of you, ah, I'm sure, a lot of you after VCon went back and you took a break, whether it's a half an hour nap, one day to spend with your family and hold hands and sing Kumbaya, whatever you did, you may have lost that momentum, you have lost that, that switch on mode, you understand? All right, and ever since I left Vicon, I haven't even gone home. I've isolated myself in a hotel. I've been having non-stop meetings with everyone. All right, I've been on the phone non-stop, making Wednesday messages, doing Instagram live. My life has not stopped, and I realized that about all these great ones, they are consistent. Consistency is the ultimate secret. I realized this. They were not born great networkers. They don't know more than you. Their presentation is not better than you, but they're consistent. And if you want to achieve financial freedom, if you want to, to go up on stage one day and tell your story like the great ones you saw at VCon, it's just consistency. Your greatest challenge is you're not consistent. So if there's one application, if there's one thing you want to keep consistent, is this power of VCon, the mojo of VCon, the realization of VCon, the passion of VCon, the energy of VCon. Keep it consistent. Don't switch off. Don't slow down. Diwali is coming. All right. Christmas is coming. New Year is coming. Everyone is planning this. You know what they're planning? They're planning how to switch off. It is sad. It saddens me. Right? You don't need to switch off for Diwali. I celebrate Diwali, but I don't switch off. I don't need a break from life. I don't need a break from chasing my dreams. I don't need a break from living this unbelievable adventure with QNET, the V, Japa, Dato Sri Vijay. I don't need a break for being Patman Senati Raja. I don't need a break from being a warrior. I don't need a break from working hard because I love what I do. It's no longer work. You understand? Right, so be consistent. I'm telling you, if you want to be successful, if you have a dream you're willing to fight for and die for, if I could give you one advice, is be consistent. Please don't switch off. Please don't slow down. Please don't distra be distracted by the bull sugar of normal people. Please don't surrender to the drama around you, okay? You're doing the right thing. You're doing it for your family. You're doing it for your kids. You're doing it for your parents. They may not understand when you're paying the price, but they will understand when they understand you. Are you guys with me? All right? And I want you to be consistent. I want you to stay focused. This is not just a business. This is your life. This is the greatest decision you have made. I want you to push yourself harder and push yourself until it hurts. And just when you feel like giving up, play Latika. Remember your dream, all right? And keep pushing yourself even more. Just when the whole world laughs at you, play the song, I don't care. I love it. And jump out of your car and go to the next presentation. And don't fear anyone. Don't fear anything. Don't surrender to the, to the morons out there, whether it's the newspaper, whatever bull sugar doesn't matter be a warrior and fight for the dreams of your people and fight for everything you believe in all right but be consistent apply everything you have learned from vcon from from all the videos you have watched apply it and be consistent and never switch off that's what i'm begging you i'm asking you because i saw your eyes at vcon i i saw that that magic. I saw that light. I saw that fire in your hearts. Don't let it die off. Don't let it slow down. Let it rage as an inferno. Right? And, and transfer the energy. Transfer the mojo. And let's fulfill the vision of Japa and Dato Sri Vijay of touching a billion hearts. Love you guys. I actually miss you guys a lot uh, from VCon. I miss everyone. The V partners, AVPs, VCs, my core, the alliance. I miss Japa and Datu Sri Vijay so much. Being that close with them, you know, I, it was unbelievable. So I love you guys. And remember, apply everything you have learned. Just don't learn for the sake of learning. And whatever you do, 
be consistent and never, never switch off. Are you with me? Love you guys.